Okay, hello everybody, Paul Richards here, and I was searching the internet for videos on how to integrate X keys with OBS and found there were none, so we had to make one. Um, so what I have here is OBS, okay, I've got my OBS here, and I have my macro works settings here. So let me just quickly show you what we're talking about here. So X keys creates these really great little keyboards where you can like kind of do things and control with buttons. It really makes like any live streaming software much cooler and better. Um, and then there's also these little buttons. Little buttons you can just press buttons and have them do something. So from a church standpoint, from an ease of use live streaming standpoint, if you just want to have one button to start streaming, you can do that. One button to move the camera or start recording, you can do that. And for a lot of people, when live streaming is more complicated than it needs to be a lot of times, that is why we are gonna show you how this works. So first of all, let's take a look at the macro um, software here first. So let me go ahead and zoom into this. So the macro software, this is where we map what the keys are actually gonna do. So for example, if I go ahead and say that I want this key here to be a keystroke, and let's say I want this keystroke to be Control, Shift, Alt, um, that key, comma, boom. Okay, so that is what this key is going to do every time I push it. So every time I push this button, that's gonna happen, okay? And what I can do, is now I can just go back to here. I'm going to close macro works and now I'm going to look just at OBS here. Now in OBS, under settings, there is a hotkey setting and all we have to do is map the hotkey setting to what we want. So I've already actually mapped one here uh, to show and hide a camera based on these keys being pressed. So now if I push this button, where is it? Which button did I push? Control Shift Alt. Is the wrong camera up? Control Shift Alt. There. So show and hide. And my macro works. Just needs to do a double check here. And that's basically how it's done, guys. So, gives you an idea. Um, push this button. When that button's pushed, we do Control Shift Alt. This. Go ahead and do that again. Oh gosh, delete selected. Control Shift Alt. That button. Done. And those extra keys are, are the up, the, the lift off keys. So, now when I hit this button. That's what it does. Close. And now the button turns it off and on. There we go. So that's how it works in OBS. I just wanted to give you guys that heads up. Um, also going to be doing a video on XSplit. The vMix integration is uh, really the easiest one. They have MIDI control. And it also works with the new Tech TriCaster. It's all been integrated. So there you go. Thanks for watching, guys. And uh, if you're interested in more videos like this, uh, don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel. We've got a ton of videos on this kind of stuff, and I hope that it is um, beneficial to you. Click to watch another exciting PTZ Optics video, and don't forget to subscribe. Tune in Fridays at 11 a.m. Pacific, 2 p.m. Eastern, to join our live show. Industry experts interviewed every week.